With a busy summer of sport ahead, including the Women's Football World Cup in France this week, the BBC is focusing on women's sport. The British racing driver Catherine Legg is one of the few women competing at the highest level. And while she's a big name in America, she's little known here in the UK. She says she's had to fight and claw for every opportunity in a sport where just 5% of participants are women. Our sports correspondent Katie Gornall has the story. The car doesn't know the difference. Like you get in that car, it doesn't know whether you're male, female, black or white. In motor racing, it's a battle just to make it into the car, never mind to the front of the grid. Catherine Legg has proved herself time and time again. One of Britain's most talented drivers, she's also one of only a handful of women making a living behind the wheel. I had to fight and claw my way through racing, and so I had to take every opportunity that was thrown my way, and I've driven my fair share of really bad cars as well to get to where I am. It is a beautiful day. Her latest opportunity comes as the lead driver in a groundbreaking all-female team. Catherine Legg from the UK. American fans know her well. Legg was forced to move to the US to get her break in the sport, despite holding her own against Lewis Hamilton and Jensen Button at junior level. Let's go. Her team's first outing of the season is here at Florida's iconic Daytona track for a grueling 24-hour race. This is a sport that's all about performance and behind the wheel of that car, gender is irrelevant. But this team knows that setting the pace on the track can have a big impact. Currently, just 5% of people working in motorsport are women. The latest push to raise their profile has seen the launch of the W Series, a women-only series that has sharply divided opinion. It's been done without the involvement of the sport's governing body, the FIA, who want to see more women racing against men. We don't have enough women starting. And so if you don't have enough starting from the base, of course it's difficult to have more on the top. We are really concern and we are working very hard to increase this base. Catherine Legg and Dan Clark, and they've had quite an interesting battle this year. Women may be in the minority, but they're chasing the same rewards and taking the same risks. Oh, huge crash, oh no! It's Catherine. Legg escaped from this 2006 crash with only bruising and was soon back out on the track. I've always erred on the side of not wanting to be any different. I want to be taken seriously as a race car driver. I have done everything that the guys have done in order to be no different. As drivers, all they care about is the chequered flag. But as women, this team knows they're racing for something more than just a win. Katie Gornall, BBC News, Daytona, Florida.